I'm standing here in my kitchen making dinner, I'm going to do a little video review of this DIY black tea mango flavor. Mm. So anyway, um, I like tea of all varieties. This stuff is a loose leaf and hang on, it kind of looks like tobacco if you can see that in there, quite honestly. And it smells like fruit leather. So, and yes, I use my teeth for many, many things. It comes with its own little tea infuser, which has this little tiny plate to sit on. And give me one moment while I drain it. It's so cute. Look how cute it is. It's a little leaf. And then you just set it on its little tray so it doesn't leak all over the floor. It's a standard black tea. I've got it in my awesome cup. It's pretty good. It's got a slight mango hint to it, but it's not like overpowering and it's not like overly sweetened. I hate sweet tea personally, so that's good for me. Uh, yeah, this is pretty good stuff. Most fruit flavored teas, they don't really have any fruit flavor to them. In my experience, we're going to move this way now because I'm cooking. But this one is pretty good. It's got a nice strong but not overpowering flavor of mango to it. Um, so yeah, it's it's a really good tea. I quite like it. I'm definitely going to get some more of this stuff because I love tea and I love mangoes. So yeah, good stuff. If you like mangoes and tea, you should definitely check it out. It is nice delicious and affordable and now I'm gonna get back to my cooking so I don't burn anything so but yeah definitely check this out it's called DIY tea I don't know why it's called DIY tea but that's what they call it I think it's some kind of weight loss product though because zone C365 it just sounds like a weight loss company but whatever it tastes good that's all that matters to me